The American embassy was like the symbol of American imperialism right in the center of Tehran. این که حالا جنبش دانشجویی هستیم با این حال تصرف یا اشغال سفارت امریکا اقدام خوب خیلی مهم می بود I go to the window and I look out I see a vast crowd of people The embassy alarm system goes off people are yelling Finally we just surrendered I gave up my weapon a blindfold me I thought it was it for me The American embassy in Tehran is in the hands of Muslim students tonight. They're holding the Americans hostage. It's an extraordinary act and an audacious act to humiliate the United States. And it was having a big impact on the American public. We were helping the American people to understand the consequences of the actions of their government in Iran. There was an unholy pact between the United States and Iran. In one word, the special relationship. It seemed to me that the oil wealth wasn't trickling down to the people. And that made me very angry. The social fragmentation, the corruption, that was the fuel. Khomeini was the match. The revolution became a monster. I thought we were going to have freedom. They were just absolutely convinced that we were spies. My interrogation was unpleasant, let's put it that way. The hostages have been there for almost a year now. This is going to be the basis of this election. This was fully televised, and it was very television friendly. Carter was convinced that he could solve this. He never dreamed it would go on 444 days. How do you think this will all turn out? Why did this go on for so long? I never thought of myself as a hero. I wanted to make it home.